All right, guys. Welcome back to another adventure. So, at this episode, we are about to do another revisit. A very creepy and big abandoned monastery in the French region of Belgium. So, basically, the place that is standing right further in the bush actually was built in the 18th century. But the original buildings are from the 19th century. So, actually, this place is kind of old. Many people came here to vandalize stuff, but still, well, actually, still, some stuff is left behind, like old beds, some furniture here and there. But the place is extremely creepy. I already did two episodes here, one a day, one at night, and I can tell you guys, it is haunted. Because we heard strange things, especially at night time. But I'm gonna show you then the spots where we heard like unstable noises, like footsteps, cracking noises, and other stuff. And literally, it was terrifying, guys. But now we are back three years later because the last time I was here was in 2018. You can see a glimpse of it already. It's completely covered with um, plants and other stuff. And yeah, I'm ready for it, guys. We are now back for the third time, test time. Me and Mathieu are going to explore this one, guys. So, if you're ready for adventures, smash a big like, like you never did before. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications because it's actually the best support you can give me and it's actually for free. So I'm gonna put also the previous episodes in the description box below so you can check it out by yourself and that you can experience how it was at night, guys. Alright, enough talking. Let's do this. And check it out sort of chalet we found full with random stuff it's actually pretty pretty damaged and there we have the monastery itself we just have seen people inside already other explorers it's still a famous spot bro in the urbex world yeah well i was actually surprised to see that still people are going there it was yeah. uh, kind of difficult to get in here yeah? well actually it was kind of okay but still <laughs> if you're not experienced with going inside buildings man you have actually some trouble then <laughs> yeah and i have a, a little knee fracture so for me it was difficult for him it was easy <laughs> <laughs> like i was man <laughs> all right check it out this building from outside before i go and enter the house uh enter the monastery it's not a house it will be actually a big house then if it was a house <laughs> but check it out it's actually so spooky especially from far away whoa it's completely covered by bush the nature has taken over the spot yeah it is and actually, if you look good, I know these are the sewage systems of um, the, this old, yeah, I would say, monastery? It's a monastery, yeah. Yeah, and um, actually it's going like in a Tetris style, like, um, you know, like up, going straight down, mm. uh, straight forward, down, down, Yeah. and somewhere there it's going downside. Yeah, we have a spooky basement as well, but all for later. All right, we're gonna enter the building right now. Let's do this. And here we are, guys. The hallway of doom. Look, bro, creepy this is actually. Yeah, actually. Doing this place. Hello. All right, man, check it out. This is why people come to here for this view here. But it's cross in the middle of this building. It's really crazy, man. It's very spooky as well. You see this view right now, guys. Wow, unbelievable. Here? Yeah. You want this one or the little one? Uh, I'm gonna use the big one here. Yeah. Okay, can you just hold it? It's actually so dark here, man, you know? Yeah, it is. Without light, it will be not good. Uh, should be good. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, 
check it out. Very spooky rooms. Look at it, so decay, like crazy. And this really gives you actually a extra spooky feeling. I gotta be honest, at night time, I was actually afraid. Because look how creepy this is, guys. It's a very spooky building, man. All right. Like I already said, guys, there's so many rooms. I'm gonna show you every single room. I already did that back in 2018 to show you actually that in almost every room. If you want to see all the rooms, peeps, just check out the description box below, like I already mentioned. And right over here, we are actually outside. But I don't remember, it was so overground. <laughs> Bro, this wasn't like this, man. This was not like this. Now you barely can walk here, man. There's actually one open zone here, literally. And was there something to explore? To see? Well, it was just... Uh, no, actually not. But okay. it was pretty easier to go to other buildings, you know? Now it's completely... Grown. Grown, yeah. Overgrown. Actually, wait, that there is a cone on the roof. Many vandals came here to destroy the place, actually, which is sad as well, eh? Yeah, you see and putting things on fire and some, something like that. Yeah, lots I remember of there is the door that goes to the basement, actually. Right over there in front of you. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, we can go to the basement. We're gonna do that later. First of all, I'm gonna show you some cool spots here. Very magnificent doors. I really like this building, man. It's so cool because it's so old, you know. But also dangerous, so we have to be careful where we're walking, actually. All right, check it out. Most of the rooms are empty, but look at the structure, man. This is gorgeous. Oh, check it out. It's like in a new chateau, my friend. This is so beautiful. It's very beautiful architecture. They really did a good job at here, man. Gorgeous. Alright. Oh, we better watch out for the roof. It's actually going to collapse. Yeah, yeah. True. Alright, I'm gonna go back to there. Actually, there's a lot of glass on the ground here. Because they smashed these windows in actually. Which is super super sad. Alright. Over here we have to watch out as well because it's radical collapse everywhere. So some small rooms. Look another view. Check it out. Alright, check it out. I know you're safe. The floor is a wood. Hopefully not gonna collapse with the floor. <laughs> Otherwise... Let's check it out. Very beautiful view. Of a spot here. Wow, such a landscape. Very lovely to see. And over here actually is the is the is the main gate of this place. Alright, let me go back. See? Old furniture still left behind. I'm gonna go back. Alright guys, we are back at the main building right now. We're gonna focus here more than other buildings. The the buildings there are actually empty, so nothing special. It is pretty damaged and dangerous. But here, this area, I remember, there are some cool spots here. And I'm curious how it is right now, actually. Wow, it's literally like a monastery from The Walking Dead, guys. <laughs> All right. Okay, I remember this room. Wow, so destroyed right over here. Such a shame. But this was a sort of altar there, as you see. I remember, 
Yeah, and details of podium here. So we actually did a photo shoot here, a test spot here, but there, with some smoke and so on. But it's like it took fire here, bro. You see? Yeah, it definitely took. They put this on fire here. Check it out. Some seats. And actually, you can see where they started the fire. It was here in the corner. Yeah, indeed. You can see it's very good because it's all black. The ceiling is all black as well from the smoke, you know. And check it out. This is the altar. I'm going to show it from close. It changed so much, bro. <laughs> all right. Everywhere you see graffiti on the walls. They even came here to drink beers. It's not me. <laughs> no, not this time. It is not this bro. <laughs> All right. Look at the structure here. It's some bricks. Really beautiful. Alright, gonna go to here. Check it out. So basically this building goes in a square as you see. Came from there. Now we are here at the seat. I just one big square bro. I remember there were actually some oh, yeah, statues yeah. here yeah, standing as well. There were some statues standing here. Now, of course, it's gone already, it's normal. You know that the uh, cost, it's uh, filled in, in the other room. Yeah. It's uh, with uh, gold. Yeah. But it's a very oppressive structure, bro. Fascinating. Look, another view from the cross in the middle of this building. Just say what you want, bro, but it's literally like a sand out of the walking dead, man. Yeah, it is. <laughs> So gorgeous. Wow. Look, the lights are hanging down from the ceiling actually. Very sad. All right. We're gonna go to a higher floor. I'm using the staircase over here. I'm actually glad I'm back because now I know it's actually completely messed up right now. But still some parts are gorgeous. But most of the place is already damaged. Eh? All right. See, we do have the same here, like at the main floor. But with, of course, more rooms and so on. Okay, it is a little strange. This is the first time I found a picture right over here, guys. I don't remember this picture. Very bizarre actually. You just have some sleeping rooms here because and then slept here as well and the priests and so on. This is actually a very well known monastery in the neighborhood actually. The monastery of Vicky. Oh beautiful. Yeah, that's nice. Wow. Fancy. You need to go to toilet. <laughs> you want to go to the toilet, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> you should give it a try. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you would. <laughs> Alright, check it out. It's pretty dark inside here. Yeah, yeah. it's so dark. But it's scary, bro. Dark or not, it's pretty scary actually. Oh, it's dangerous to go to the attic actually. And it was I'm not in the mood to risk my life today in an abandoned monastery. Yeah, it smells so bad, bro. It smells like DK, you know? Oh, have you ever seen a toilet like this? 
I've never seen a toilet like this, bro. Check it out. Mm. <laughs> it's funny, man, you know? Mm, yeah. So bizarre to see, man. It's for huge people like you. You're taller than me. You know, maybe you're going to use this one and I'm going to use the next mm -hmm. two. <laughs> Imagine. And then we can talk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Look, bro, it's gonna be dangerous to go to the ceiling, actually, you know? Yeah. I mean, uh, to the ceiling. What the hell am I saying? To the attic, I mean. <laughs> I'm not Spider Man, bro. I cannot climb on walls, you know? <laughs> you better not be Spider Man. <laughs> I would, like, come every, I would never come into this car again. <laughs> <laughs> Big spiders, my friend. Big spiders. You, I know you don't like the spiders. Have your back. But I'm not gonna risk my life to go to the attic, guys. Look at this, man. It's completely collapsed. But on the attic, I remember we heard like many strange noises, cracking noises right behind. There's actually some voices as well. Strange voices, unexplainable voices. The voices, you know. Like whispering the whole time, I don't know who the hell it was, or I don't know man, this place was super terrifying at night time, man. that's the only thing I remember. I'm never gonna do this again at night time actually, because it's so dangerous, it could be here filled with junkies, you know, and they can attack you and kill you, you know, by stabbing you with a knife. Well, in the French side uh, of Belgium, it's pretty, pretty gore, the people there, pretty dangerous, it's yeah. not like in uh, Flanders, it's, uh, they, here they don't care actually if you're uh, poor, rich, as long as you have something in their hands and they want it, they're gonna just make the habit, so... Yeah, indeed, indeed. Nighttime is a bad explorer here. Dangerous, yeah. very dangerous. And because it's so big, it's a cool, it's a good spot for, uh, for them, you know, yep. to attack people. Yep. But look again, guys, another gorgeous view. Whoa. It's from the ceiling, bro. Ghost noise, you heard that? You heard a ghost noise? Uh, I don't think it was a ghost, I'm cracking. It's the alley that makes noises, bro. <laughs> right, maybe you can check out through the window right over here. Okay, it's more safe. But I'm really so in love with this view. Oh. Actually, if you do. Mosquito, bro, check it out. Ooh. It's gonna attack you. <laughs> yeah, maybe. All right. But look how dangerous, bro. It's Everything is ready to collapse. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna go to that this time. But you can't. You, you just can't because you have to go from there. Yeah, we have to use a staircase, but I'm not gonna risk my life today, actually. It's not worth it, bro, to die here, you know? And this Terrifying spots. And also we're going to break the 3,000 euros camera and we, yeah, yeah, yeah. we don't want this. Not only the camera uh, or phone, you know. <laughs> oh. Okay, oh, no, I was actually confused because your back it's like a square. I can hear this. Blood. Blood. It's fake blood, bro. It's painted. Are you sure about that? I'm pretty sure. Dun 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 dun. All right, guys, we're gonna go back outside. Like what I said, it's so sad to see how it is right now. It's heartbreaking, man. But still, it's creepy as hell. <laughs> That's all I can say, man. All right, we're back outside. I'm glad because the smell inside is actually bad. Smells a little like DK, you know. But anyways, this was the Rivers of the Peeps. Real hope from bottom heart. You enjoyed this one. The other two previous episodes were actually for over 30 minutes long. Especially the first time was almost one hour of footage, and the second one where we went back at night, it was actually above the 40 minutes long. So, but this time it's not that long, guys. So yeah. It is literally heartbreaking to see the big difference between 2018 and 2021. So yeah, this was it guys. We really hope you enjoyed this one. And if you do, smash the like, subscribe to the channel, turn the notifications. And yeah, let me know down below your opinion about this. What do you remember from the last time? If you have saw those videos. And if you have, like I already said, just check the description box below. Are you gonna find two episodes there? So 
then you can also let me know what do you think of the difference so and so on i'm looking forward to read your comments guys and again thanks so much for watching for the sport and for watching this episode actually now but you you ready to leave this place i'm ready let's do this see you another peeps